A, a nice day in store for us with those highs returning to the 80s. Here's a look at downtown Tyler with our Skyview camera brought to you by the Tyler Neurosurgical Associates. We are seeing some cloud cover out there this morning, especially on the horizon, but also the sun peeking through in places as well. We're going to see a mix of clouds and sunshine for our day today. Temperatures right now in the Arklatex are sitting out in the low to mid 60s, so it is a, a cool start to our day today, at least relatively speaking here, uh, a lot more comfortable than what we have been seeing as of late as we take a look at the temperatures around the region. We've got some low 70s down to Houston and then some 50s over into central Oklahoma and north Texas. 56 degrees right now in Wichita Falls. For our day today, we will see a mix of clouds and sunshine with generally more cloud cover during the morning hours than what we'll see during the afternoon. Although this afternoon there will still be some passing clouds out there. High temperatures today make it to the middle 80s, so it will be uh, warmer than this past weekend, but actually this is around average for this time of the year. So overall, another pleasant day with relatively low humidity for us. So a good day to get outside and enjoy. Here's a look at what Futurecast has going forward. You can see the clouds slide out of here as we head into the afternoon. New clouds may develop as we head into the afternoon hours, but uh, we should be dry for our day today. Rain and storms develop well off to our west and will likely stay out there as we head into tonight. Now, Tuesday morning will be dry, but Tuesday afternoon can't rule out a few isolated showers and maybe a thunderstorm developing. So just keep that eye to the sky by 5 p.m. We could still see a few showers and storms out there. Now, as we head into the overnight hours, Tuesday into Wednesday, notice how there's going to be a complex of thunderstorms just off to our west. Futurecast does have this weakening before it gets here in East Texas, but I can't rule out this being a little bit stronger than what Futurecast is showing and potentially moving through portions of our area. Uh, again, with that northwest flow in the upper levels of the atmosphere, we typically do get some of these thunderstorms uh, moving through the areas as we head into the overnight hours, but that's something we'll be watching into Tuesday night and Wednesday morning. Wednesday morning, on the other hand, though, will be mostly dry, but shower and storm chances will increase for the day on Wednesday, especially during the afternoon hours. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. Now we are going to see the chances of rain tomorrow, tomorrow night and Wednesday. And then after that, we're drying things out. Once again, we are going to see those high temperatures warming into the weekend, back into the upper 80s and even a few low 90s as we head into Saturday and Sunday. For Deep East Texas, it is more of the same. Keep that eye to the sky Tuesday, Tuesday night and Wednesday, and then we're dry and warm heading into this weekend. All right. I mean, you know, Friday it was hot, mm -hmm. but uh, it, the weekend was pretty nice, yeah. excluding Friday evening. It was a little humid yesterday, I do have to say. <laughs> uh, yeah, that is true. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. I hope everyone was able to enjoy the weather this past yeah. weekend because it's it's probably going to be one of the cooler weekends we'll see for another several months. So, uh -oh. you know, well, <laughs> it is what it is. Yep. Yeah, Andrew, thank you.